Hello there. Barristers are the latest to catch the industrial action bug. Quick, get a flight to Rwanda going. Well, I did say a couple of weeks ago that this striking bug would return with a vengeance. And boy, it's more virulent than any Covid strain. And the latest sector of the workforce to demand more is barristers. And members of the Criminal Bar Association voted by over 80% to decline any new work from next Monday the 27th of June. Walkouts are planned on certain dates, and if they don't get their way, then it's a full-on strike from July the 18th. Now, barristers are used specifically because they can argue a case. They are advocates who use eloquence and long sentences with lots of Latin in them to win their cases. But their powers of persuasion don't appear to have extended to getting more legal aid money and it could lead to 7,000 cases a month being halted, with barristers carrying placards outside the Old Bailey and other courts around England and Wales. And then there's the issue of the Bar Council warning that there would be a shortage of barristers after the pandemic due to a 35% fall in pupillages. Surely that would attract more pay. Anyway, it won't be long before we're reading headlines about who's not on strike. Oh, and have you heard that Rwanda's Anglican leader, Archbishop Laurent Mbanda, has slammed our Archbishop of Canterbury, Justin Welby, for the way he criticised the UK's Rwanda flight policy? Well, Archbishop Mbanda said the policy is not immoral and defended it, saying it will help tackle a global crisis. And he knows a thing or two about this, having himself spent time as a refugee in Burundi, Rwanda's southern neighbour. <laughs>